Hi everybody. I uh, wanted to share with you what I've been working on recently. Uh, I've been using in the past this thing called WordNet, which is by Princeton University. They've created a, a sort of hierarchical model of uh, the English language called WordNet. Uh, here, for example, I can do a search on WordNet and pull back uh, the response for the word Jaguar. Uh, for a given sense of the word Jaguar, there's these things called the uh, direct hypernym. It says that a Jaguar is a member of, or is a big cat or a cat. Uh, and that, as a matter of fact, you can go through and say that a Jaguar is a feline, a Jaguar is a mammal, uh, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So they, they have a dictionary that, that tells us this. What I've done is I've indexed uh, that information here in an instance of solar. So I can do a search for uh, you know, sense underscore lima colon puma. I'm searching for a puma, and this is a large American feline resembling a lion. That's a puma. Um, so what I have is I have an instance of program AB running uh, that basically says, is a star a star? And it calls out to Python with this method, passing in the first star and the second tar star as arguments. And then in my method here, I create the syntax to effectively say, for, the, for x, what you're searching for, traverse up the hierarchy for all things that are x, uh, or that x is a type of all of those things, and then and that query with whatever y was. And if the hit count on this comes back greater than zero, then the answer is yes. As a matter of fact, that whatever x is, it's a subclass or a hyponym of y. And then uh, Python will respond back with this. So let's try out a couple examples here. Um, I use WebKit speech recognition, and uh, we'll start here. Uh, is a puma a cat? Feline mammal usually having thick soft fur and no ability to roar. Domestic cats. Wild cats. Yes, a puma is a cat. Is a puma an animal? Is a puma an animal? A living organism characterized by voluntary movement. Yes. A puma is an animal. Is a Model T a car? A motor vehicle with four wheels, usually propelled by an internal combustion engine. He needs a car to get to work. Yes, a Model T is a car. So what you see we've done here is we've basically taken speech recognition and a natural language query interface uh, to do a search against Solar, and Solar is using this graph query that I contributed to it, which allows you to traverse through uh, basically a knowledge graph in Solar, and then based on intersections in that result set, to, to draw conclusions on whether or not uh, A is a subclass of B, for example. So this is just kind of a, an initial start at you know, bringing in other you know, knowledge repositories to, to give the, the robots some base understanding, and, uh, and I hope you uh, liked it. Thank you.